Welcome back to BLB Adventures. We are at Cannon Beach State Park in Oregon and we're gonna do some epic tide pool finds. So we got Luca and Brayden right here. It's just after low tide and we're gonna look for starfish and all kinds of cool creatures. So gotta work our way past the water. And then if you look at the rock, you can see some starfish on that rock right there. And now we're gonna go try to see what we can find. So there's a lot of people out here. Look at all the oysters on this rock. And then there's two starfish. And there's also a sea anemone. Up here comes the water. <laughs> Definitely not wearing the most appropriate shoes right now. We got all kinds of starfish, sea anemones in the water. Check this out. Look at the sea anemones in the water. There's little green things right here. See the sea anemones right there in the water? There goes the sea anemone. There's some more over there. More starfish. Lots of starfish. <laughs> <laughs> it is cool. We're going over to the big rocks. <laughs> there goes the iconic dome of Cannon Peach. How cold is this water, Luca? <laughs> is this like the Texas and Florida beaches with the warm ocean? <laughs> Do you, would you want to go into this water? Look at all the starfish. Yeah. That is a big crab shell. You know what's inside of there? Nothing. A shell! Hey, that thing got picked apart. <laughs> this is Texas, folks. Where it's 100 degrees in Austin right now, and you come out here and it's 50 degrees. It's like night and day different. All right, let's go by these rocks right here, boys. Look at all the anemones growing on this rock. This is insane. Look at all these. See ya? They're alive and they shrink up. And then you can see the shellfish inside these barnacles. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna take one more. Oh, look at that. Look at that crab shell. Look at that eating crab. That's a big crab down there at the bottom of the pond. See straight ahead? Oh, yeah. All right, we're gonna go across. There goes that massive sea star. Look at that massive sea star right there. Yeah. Can we just stay on the sand boat? Okay, don't don't cross the rocks, Luca. Oh yeah, that's a really close sea star right there. There goes the sea star. Very up close and personal. So cool. Look at that. Look anemone. at these anemones. Look, they have a little butt. Mommy <laughs> wanted us to take a picture. Take a picture of the yeah. butt. Look at these anemones. Look at that bright orange sea star that's right there. It, it and there's some the other thing. Star. I mean, the bright purple <laughs> sea star. That, that. Now, let's see if we can find a sea star. So, the people that work for the park service said, those anemones, the green anemones could live to be over a hundred years old. And the anemones we just showed you are probably 40 to 50 years old, which is insane. So you can see over here. Oh yeah, there's a bright orange sea star. We're not allowed to go past this point to protect all the animals on this rock. So you can see over there, there's a bright orange sea star. There's a red one, there's a purple one. There's a lot of anemones over here in these pools. Yep, we're not allowed to touch them because our touch causes disease. But over here, you can see a purple and an orange. Let's see. Oh yeah, there goes a bright purple sea star. Look at, look at this little shells right there. It's so awesome. I've never seen so many sea stars in my life. All these mullets 
This rock is covered in oysters and mud. What's the coolest thing you've seen so far? Sea star? How cool are those anemones? Can you tell me what's different about... Oh yeah, look at that. That's bright. Oh, there's a sea star right here. Like this. Yep, and there's another one hidden right down there in the water. There goes, oh, no, there goes a sea star. Oh, there it is. And then look at those barnacles. It looks like almost like coral right there. It's some kind of animal. So you got that pink thingy right there. And then you have all these anemones. Oh, there's a blue anemone. So we're respecting nature, we're not touching anything. You can see these barnacles right Daddy, here. Don't touch, them. Don't touch them. So we just got pointed out this animal right here. It's called a luna branch. And it looks like a feather, but you can see it's a creature. And look how beautiful that is. You can see the antennas up front, it's going its so way around. Like I've never seen anything like this in my life. This is so pretty. Hey, Daddy, so amazing. We're gonna take a picture of this real quick. We're gonna see what other awesome things we could find. So Luca, tell everyone what you found. I found two baby little Look at, right there. There's a baby one and there's a little bit bigger one right there you can see the baby one right there that is so awesome and we just found a little mini crab crawling by the rocks so you can see the crab down there crawling on the water on the bottom of the tide pool it's crawling around as this is a deeper pool there's a lot of food for all these animals in here the tide's starting to come back in, as you can see. So the water is coming up pretty quickly. This pool is growing. When we first got here, this was not covered in water, and now there's more water here. You can see how fast. Look at look how fast the tide's coming in. Up oh, there it goes away. We were walking down the beach, and Luca wanted to check out this rock, and we just found a graveyard of massive Dungeness crabs shells everywhere the birds got to them. Look at all the bird poops and look at all these crabs. They they were hiding behind here having a dandy old time eating all these crabs <laughs> just picking them apart. And then we found this cool rock, some more anemones. We're gonna see if we can find a fish or something in here. Say little. Good news. Good news. Does that see stars? Let's look around the rock. Oh, it's crazy when you look at this. But look how many shellfish and all these mussels and barnacles take over the rock. And then there's some anemones up here. And then in the corners, these are where the crabs would hide. I don't see any crabs here. We don't see any sea stars either. But we got all these crabs. And we got massive seahawk poops. Ah, oh, so gross. So disgusting. Well, we didn't find an octopus this time, but we still found a lot of awesome creatures. Thank you for watching our tide pool of adventure at Cannon Beach in Oregon. Boys, what did you think? We might do a venture in our backyard as a video. That is right, we might do a venture in our backyard. So remember, subscribe to our channel, smash the like button to turn on all notifications. New videos every week. See y'all next time. Bye.